Hi there. Today's recipe is the popular paneer butter masala. Watch how I make a low fat version of paneer makhani that you will be able to enjoy without feeling guilty. Ready to try it out at home? Did you subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for the latest updates? The main ingredients for the gravy: tomatoes. Chop them as you like. Sliced onions, cashew nuts, ginger and garlic paste or grated stick of cinnamon a bay leaf and green chilies according to your taste the dry spices coriander powder cumin powder and kashmiri red chili powder salt and a bit of sugar heat some oil in a pan i'm just adding oil you could add a combination of oil and butter temper it with bay leaves and the cinnamon add in the onions fry them briefly the onions are optional you could skip the onions let's add in the ginger garlic paste Give it a mix. Add in the dry spices. The salt and the sugar. Add in the tomatoes, the green chili, and the cashew nuts. Mix well. Lower the heat, cover, and cook till the tomatoes are done. So the tomatoes have started to sweat. Let's take a closer look. Give it a toss from time to time. Cover it and cook again. that has been cooking for 10 minutes now so let's take a final look that has released some water and the tomatoes are cooked turn off the heat and let it cool down slightly once that has cooled down just remove the bay leaf and the stick of cinnamon transfer it into a mixer jar add water as required to grind it to a fine paste just to be sure i'll strain the paste so that there are no particles or lumps in it this is what is left and this will go into the gravy i'm using 250 grams of paneer cut the paneer according to your requirement make sure that the pieces are not too small keep them aside we'll also require some butter and milk garam masala and kasuri methi finally heat the pan add in a bit of oil and about a tablespoon and a half of butter so we are adding butter at the very last stage that is just to make it a low fat recipe if you want you you could add butter to the tomato gravy so just let that melt add in a tiny bit of kashmiri red chili powder mix add in the gravy if you like the recipe do share it with your friends and post your feedback in the comment section mix it up and bring it to the boil add 
Add in the paneer pieces. Cook them in the gravy for a few minutes. Add in some milk. I am using milk for this recipe. You could add in some fresh cream. The milk keeps it low fat. Be gentle with the paneer at this stage. Let's bring it to the boil. Check the seasoning and adjust it accordingly. That's fine. Garam masala on top. Kasuri methi. Crush it in your palm. Mix lightly. That's done. Turn off the heat. You could use some beaten hung curd like me. Or some cream. As a decoration. Sprinkle some kasuri methi. Serve the paneer butter masala hot with lachha paratha, naan or rice. Enjoy!